once or twice a month, I like to bring you stuff from Amazon that has really impressed me and that I'm really excited about. And so today I have a great blend of a lot of beauty, a lot of skincare, and a whole bunch of fashion. And I can't wait to get started and show you all of those. First, I do have a numbering system and a number will come up on the screen that corresponds to the product. And then you can go down into the description box and shop that way. Everything will be there for you, including the link and the size and color for you as well. All right, we're gonna get started. We're gonna go beauty fashion, beauty fashion, I think. Let's start off with this pack of facial masks that I got. And I am so impressed with these. These are really nourishing and they plump your skin up. Now, I think that these work out to be $1.60 a piece, somewhere about that. It might be $1.69 a piece, but basically they are just loaded with really good ingredients. They are Korean masks and I've so far have used four and I really like them. So the first one is Herb Retinol Relief Mask Pack mask pack and this one nourishes skin with natural ingredients balancing AHA BHA this one controls the sebum to make the skin fresh I found that AHA and BHA also really make your skin super soft and I'm just in love with all things AHA BHA right now especially AHA glycolic acid niacinamide brightening mask this makes the makes dull skin clear and fresh and Sika Tree, and this is a relaxing mask, makes the skin clean and moisturized. And that's another Sika one I haven't tried. And then this one is Vita Ceramide. It makes dry and saggy skin firm and moisturized. You kind of have a whole bunch of things covered in these masks to get you started on your day if you want to do it in the morning or to get you relaxed at night before you do your whole entire skincare routine. So really like those and by the way 10 of them come in this pack all right this is not fashion this is not beauty either one but i want to recommend this this is the doggy breath spray that i use it's made with spearmint and cloves okay i have three dogs my one dog absolutely loves this she loves the taste of it my other two hate it but i still it does the job so well my dogs have the worst breath even though about every other year I'll have their teeth cleaned professionally, they still have terrible breath. I swear it's the food that they eat, but I feed them good food too. But this deodorizes the breath, controls plaque and dart tartar buildup, darter buildup, tartar buildup. <laughs> so I really love this. I wanted to throw it in here because I know that most of you that follow me, we have pets and we love our pets and we want to take care of them. Last time I did a skincare gadget video, it didn't do very good, but I want to recommend that you take a peek at two of the things that were in there. So this is a gua sha that has in infrared light right here. It has heat and it has massage. And this kind of triples or quadruples how relaxing gua sha is. It is rechargeable and the charge lasts for a long time and i'm just i'm loving this thing so i really wanted to recommend this to you again it has a bunch of different settings and you're going to get just a beautiful facial feeling out of this when you're using it so yes and by the way i did bring this in to show you in conjunction with this so organic castor oil and this is what i used to put on my face before i do gua sha I do all of my skincare, not except for the moisturizer, and then I will do this on top of it, just a little bit, because a little bit goes a long way with castor oil. It's kind of thick. Warm it up in your fingers before you put it on your face, and try not to get it in your hair if you're not gonna wash your hair the next morning. But, oh my word. So, one of you subscribers, hi Lori, you talked to me about the benefits of castor oil and how it's really close to the skin's natural oil production. And I went down the rabbit hole of learning about castor oil. This is so good for your skin. I'll link an article down below that just tells you how amazing this is for your skin. So what I do is I use it to do my gua sha and then I will go ahead and kind of rub it in, just massage it in a little bit more. And then I will pat off with a tissue, the excess, and then I put my moisturizer on for the night. I feel like my skin is just doing a wow turnaround. Puffiness, dull complexion, 
anything like that, you're going to really enjoy doing gua sha and get the benefits of all the vitamins in the castor oil. Now, not very long ago, I showed you this makeup bag, which I still adore and love because it sits open. And even though I'm not talking about this today, it does have pockets. It holds a ton of makeup. This is a palette I'm going to talk about in a second. It holds a ton of makeup. I'm really in love with it. But I was digging through my boxes that I haven't unpacked yet. Yes, I've been in my house for two and a half months. And I haven't quite unpacked totally yet. But here is another one that I had forgotten about and that I love. It's all right here on the side. You got a light. So you get to look down in there and see what you might be missing. So isn't that cool how it does that? I just love it. And I love that it has a lighter lining in there so that you can see things better. Let me turn that light off. But look at how much this thing holds, okay? I probably got in maybe 50% more than I got in this. So what I'll do is I'll use this at home when I'm wanting all kinds of options. And then I use this when I'm traveling. And this one, it just it folds up into a square, has a handle, awesome. This one has gussets like a suitcase does so that it gives you a little bit more room if you want to. It has them on both sides. It has pockets on both sides as well. And then inside you get some makeup organization as well. You get a zipper pocket. You get two pockets on each side. You get some pockets on the ends of it that will hold a ton. I'm telling you it holds two bottles of this powder, this big powder. So yeah, really have been enjoying this. And I think that I did read that this was one of Oprah's favorite things, you know, right like before she quit or whatever. So anyway, love that. This is restoring the health of my hair. This is the Macadamia Deep Repair Mask. It's natural oil macadamia. This, it smells so good. It smells like green apple which is my favorite scent as far as a fruit scent goes and they nailed it in here there's a ton in here eight ounces i believe it is and this mask is so thick and yummy that my hair comes out feeling like i've just had the best spa treatment on my hair and soft and i just love it i've really really been enjoying it so this is a really good deep repair mask i have very fine limp hair and i don't notice that this weighs my hair down more i really try to moisturize and baby my hair just like i do my skin because i live in a super duper dry climate and that makes everything drier and as you go through menopause, you get drier anyway. So definitely I'm in love with this one and I think you would like it too. So excited when I found this. Okay, this is an umbrella. It's not like it's a, you know, the best umbrella on the planet or anything. But what I really liked about it is that it comes in this hard shell and that it is so compact. This is one of the things that drives me insane when I want to carry an umbrella. And these are so pretty. This is kind of like an old world blue color, but look how cool it is. I'm not gonna open this in the house because as sure as I do that, I will jab myself in the eye. But I love that this one just completely folds up. And if you're out in the rain, you have this to put it in, you know, you're gonna need to open it up and let it dry, obviously, but you have this to put it in. If it is soaking wet after you use it, which why wouldn't it be because it's an umbrella that we use in the rain. I don't know why I just said that. But anyway, I love this. And it is so compact and so nice. And it just folds right up and goes back in there. And you have your umbrella completely put away. You're not getting the inside of stores super wet. You're not getting the inside of your car super wet. And you can dry it out later. So this I love. And I have a ton of really, really pretty colors. All right, you know, and I know that you know, that I'm always going to be bringing you some sort of an adorable purse. And this one is so cute. Look at the color blocking on that. Isn't that just adorable? I love that it has this black buckle accent right there. By the way, this has two big pockets, zipper, zipper. And then the buckle just snaps down there and you can do this crossbody or you can carry it just on your wrist. Such a cute purse. Look at the color blocking on the side. 
and it's just so sleek and so pretty and for me these are the things that make an outfit just adorable and yeah lately i have been completely going nuts again with accessories so we're showing a lot of accessories all right a couple of skincare things that i am just absolutely in love with so this is from misha and this is their glow balm so this is hyper moisturizing and i've had this for a little while i love this and you guys have been commenting on how my skin looks a little bit glowy underneath my makeup that's because this is what i'm using as my last step before primer misha glow balm and when it says balm it's not sticky and thick and yucky like a balm is i mean you put your finger down in there and sure you're getting a thicker product obviously it's not going to come out of that but wow this sinks into my skin so quickly it feels fantastic. I'm putting it onto my hand right here and I am just like, this just feels so good. Now, I will say that I wish that they didn't put a fragrance in here. For some reason, Misha loves that rose fragrance. I'm not a big fan of it, but look at the glow on my hand now. Let me put my other hand up so you can see the difference. This one is so hydrated and so pretty, and this one is just flat. Now, what really got me excited about this, well, first of all, it's not super duper expensive compared to everything that we are pushed at out there, but what got me about this was going and looking at the ingredients, and this baby is a powerhouse full of good ingredients. It does have niacinamide, jojoba oil, tons of other yummy yummy oils in there now i will say that if you're oily you might really not like this it's one of those moisturizers that goes so nice underneath makeup especially if you're somebody that halfway through the day your makeup just feels super dry that's me i have the driest skin and i just told you about living in a very arid climate this is fantastic and we're going into winter when the heat comes on and that makes things even drier so i love this now this next one a lot of people have talked about the Alpha Skin Care Lotion, and that is the best lotion for my feet. I love that stuff. It makes my feet feel so smooth and yummy, and it helps keep sloughing off the calluses. And even though I do use my foot file, it just helps out so much. It's a big, big bottle of it. But this one right here is from Alpha Skin Care again, and this says it is... Real results for lines and wrinkles, it intensive renewal serum, 14% glycolic acid. Okay, guess what I use this for? Underneath my eyes and on top of my eyes. I was noticing that things were getting so crinkly and they looked awful. And I'm like, there's got to be something that will help renew that area around there. If you want to have pretty skin anywhere in your body, you're going to have to slough off that old skin and have the pretty new skin underneath come through. And that's what this does, but it does it so gently and it moisturizes at the same time. So I just take a dot or two and I put it around my eyes, both of them, and I actually put it around my lips too, and I am having such great success with this. It, it just feels plumped up and refreshed, and then I go ahead and I put a super moisturizer on top of it, and this is really, really good. Shoes. Oh my goodness. Okay. These are like the blingiest, cutest, dang booties. I cannot wait to wear these this fall. When I got them, I was like, holy Moses, that's going to kill my back. That's going to kill my feet. I'm not going to be able to wear that at all. No, sir, I can wear these. And the reason is, is because you've got a one inch or an inch and a half platform in there. I would say that it's a good inch and a half platform. But down inside, it is got that little bit of fur lining and it has just a little bit of cushion down in there. But I do really love the way that they have decorated this shoe or they've just, you know, pimp my boot type thing. So you do have the zipper opening and then you have all of this bling style on this side. These are little rhinestones. You have a little silver zipper on there and then you have all kinds of accents on there. How dang cute is that? Dream Pairs, it is just a fantastic brand of shoe. They also have cute sandals. They have great pumps. I really like this shoe company. They have great style. It won't break the bank 
and yeah, you can stay on trend and have your pocketbook like you at the same time. All right, last month in one of my favorites videos, I believe, I was talking about Koki foundation and how much I was in love with that, and that's that full coverage foundation. So pretty, it is just, I love it. But this is the Koki Cosmetics, this is the Transform Mix Foundation Mixer, and this is the Dewy. They also have a matte. I don't think I've told you guys about this. I love this. So if you have a very matte, very flat foundation, and you've been hanging on to it because you don't want to throw it in the garbage. It's probably, you know, what at $40, $50 and you're just like, I can't throw that away. But you don't like the finish of it on your skin because now you're into a glowy look on your skin. This is your new best friend. A drop or two and it makes your foundation have that glowy, dewy, pretty glass-like skin. The more you put in it, the more close to the glass-like skin you're going to be. Friends change so fast. And you're going from matte and then we were glowy and then we were satin and glass skin everything changes so quickly but this kind of product can help you use up what you already have instead of having to go out and buy another you know $40 thing of foundation you can pick something like this up that's under $10 and you're set so I really like that a lot glad that I found it and then as we're winding down here I want to show you the supreme solitude prism makeup palette this is such a good combination of warm tones and cool tones i really like it it has really good quality as well they have such pretty metallics in there but without being overbearing or overdone at all they also have the cool tone browns or neutral tone browns which I love, I love that. So you're getting 18 shadows in here, great amount of shadows, and you're also getting that beautiful contrast between warm and cool. And what I also love is that when you get these light colors in here, you can mix them with anything in here, even the metallics, and lighten up your makeup if you want to. And I think that especially since we don't find very many drugstore palettes anymore. I mean, e.l.f. has some, Maybelline has some that I've not been impressed with, but it's nice to be able to find something like this that is different than everything out there that all of the high-end companies are putting out and yet still shows that it has some quality there. So really did like that. Okay, so you've been seeing the shirt all the way through. It has this cute little fluttered sleeve. It's about a half sleeve on it and it does have the cutouts on it for kind of a cold shoulder effect. The belt has the grommets all the way around it, which I think is so cute. You can see the jeans is on back there. So I just think it's really, really cute. It also comes as a duo pack and you can get all different colors. I really, really think this is a cute belt set black and then this one is the brown for fall and then i'll go ahead and i'll show you the jewelry this is just kind of a braided look on a hoop and i do believe that these are these are either 40 millimeter or 50 millimeter i like at least a 40 millimeter hoop because i wear my hair around my face and you can never see them unless i wear a little bit bigger hoop and then this little necklace right here has the little heart that is on the chain. And then this right here is just like a serpentine necklace. Bought them separately. This serpentine one might come with another necklace. That's my Amazon roundup. I hope that you did enjoy seeing everything that I have here. Thank you so much for being with me. Let me know if there's anything on Amazon that you've tried this month that I need to try as well. Love you so very much and come back around and see me very soon. Goodbye, my friends.